and today I am going to be doing a Zambian tag for you guys. I am super excited to be sharing this video with you guys and I hope you will enjoy this video. So yeah, I'm just going to be reading the questions of my phone and then I'm going to be answering them as I go, as the question goes. So what is your Zambian name? My Zambian name is Mushabase Mbewe and you don't know how many times people have pronounced my name so wrong so many times i just get used to it mush base make that's my last name <laughs> yeah people just pronounce it however they want but mushabase mbewe is the way you pronounce my name so that's my zambian name i don't have a middle name i don't know why um next question were you born in zambia yes born and raised i was born in zambia um in uh, Luansha Copper Belt uh, Thompson Hospital. Yeah, I was born in Zambia and lived there till I was 15 and then obviously moved over to England. Next question, what is your favorite Zambian movie? Um, in Zambia, they don't make a lot of movies. They have made some movies, but they're not very popular. Um, the one that was popular, it was a TV, like, series thing, it was called Love Games, and I love watching that, and I sometimes just go back to it, just to watch it, just for the sake of watching it. Um, so yeah, and I have watched the Zambian movie, but I can't remember what it was called, and yeah, so Love Games is the one, and if you haven't watched it, you need to search it on YouTube, they have it all there, you can go watch it. Um, so... Favorite Zambian song, <laughs> sing it and not add background music. <laughs> My current favorite Zambian song is um, T Boy with featuring Chef, and um, it goes like this Nekudala Naku Onapo Iwe Iwe Kuku yewa matenda yesi ya pola ah ah oh gosh <laughs> I miss you baby. But anyway, so next question, when was the last time you were in Zambia and how many times have you been to Zambia? Last time I was in Zambia was 2010, that's like nearly six years ago. Girl, you need to get your ass back over to Zambia. Yeah, 2010, um, I haven't been back since then. I've only been there once since I moved over to England, so yeah. <laughs> um what tribe are you i'm chewa uh say something in your tribal language i have no idea i don't speak chichewa i'm fluent in bemba i understand nyanja um so i don't know i'm probably gonna say in chichewa <laughs> i have no idea i have no idea i yeah, I grew up in Copper Belt where uh, Bemba is spoken most of the time. So I'll say something in Bemba, Mudishani, Gamlet Damba video, Commente, Panshi, Tumone, Ofem De Remba. Namushta subscribe to YouTube channel, Mushta Koshia, Navena Zambia. Yeah. <laughs> so next question is what do you like most about zambia i like zambia because it's a peaceful country there is no like wars or anything like that and everyone is just loving and caring and kind and you know everyone knows everybody in your neighborhood you know one another you know your neighbors take care of your children you take care of their children they look out for each other that's something i love about 
you know, back home in Zambia. Um, so what do you hate most about Zambia? Ah, <laughs> what do I hate? I hate the fact that there's uh, corruption, a lot of corruption there and you can't get things done unless you've got a bit of mullah. So next question, do you have any nicknames? Do I have any nicknames? I wouldn't say, but my name has been shortened to Musha because most people can't pronounce the rest of my name. So Musha is what everyone calls me. Um, yeah, so I would say that would be my nickname, I guess. But it's just short for my own name. Um, let's see. What makes you different from other Zambians? Well, <laughs> what makes me different from other Zambians? Like everybody else, you know, everyone's different in their own beautiful way. So I am different in my own kind of, you know, way. So... Yeah, I guess that makes me different from everybody else because we're, we're all different at the end of the day. We all want different things in life. So I would say that makes me different. Um, do you speak your language? Huh? Okay, do you speak your language? I do speak bemba <laughs> i do speak bemba yes i i understand nyanja i speak a bit of nyanja um do you speak pidgin english uh no i can understand a bit of pidgin english because my hairdresser she's nigerian and she taught me a bit of uh pidgin english if you're watching prissy hey um what around your house represents your culture uh, I had to go and get it. I wasn't ready for this. But I have this picture of a woman with a child on her back and she's cooking. And I got this from my grandma back home. And yeah, I think it's just a good picture. It reminds me of where I come from. So yes, that thing, whatever it is, that picture. What is a ridiculous question? you were asked about your culture i've never been asked a ridiculous question about my coach i wouldn't say anyone has asked me a ridiculous question about my culture but um being in this country when you come from somewhere you know like africa you get loads of stupid questions like did you live in a hut where the lions running about in your you know where you live do you have to you know, can you can you just walk past and the giraffe is just there? Um, they ask all sorts of questions. So sometimes I used to be, you know, I used to act like an idiot as well, and I'd be like, yeah, you know, I when I got some scars, I'd be like, I got these fighting lions and shit, and <laughs> you used to sleep in a hut and you'd be sleeping outside and you know. Your legs are still outside and snakes will be rolling on your legs and they'd be like, really? And we're like, yeah, Africa, you know? But yeah, sometimes you've got to answer a stupid question with a sarcastic answer. So yeah, I think that is all for this video. And if you are Zambian and you are watching this video, I tag you to post a Zambian tag and tag me in it and let me know um how it goes for you so yeah guys that is all for this video if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and obviously share to anyone who might find it interesting or entertaining for them so yeah guys that's all for me uh, 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 uh. bye until next time bye bye I can't sing. <laughs>